taken by Albrighton. Oh, and it, it's an own goal. Oh, it's crazy. Darren Bent. Well, what a desperate beginning for Derby. Well, there's mistakes all around here. First of all, it looks as though Carson can come for the cross. They don't win the first ball. Darren Bent looks at it all the time in the world to clear that with his left foot. Slices it into the corner of the net. Here it comes again. Could Carson come for it? He starts to. I think that's a ball he can't get. That's inside the six-yard box. And it comes off bed. And just leaves it for Darren Bent. Darren Bent made a good run to get back onto the punt. Right in. Had to keep from dealing with it. Hughes able to loft it back in again. And it's glanced in. And uh, straight away, Derby have bounced back, and Darren Bent has got a goal at both ends. A much happier man now. Well, he didn't need to get much power, and it's a, just glanced off his forehead. It skipped off the surface. Nothing really that Smichael can do about it. Just the ball's played back into a good area. And he makes up for that error earlier on with a really clever header. He can't get it in at the near post, so just lets it glance off his head and into the far corner. Not enough power from Smichael with the first punch. Hughes with the ball into the box. He's still got a lot of work to do. He just skipped off the surface. They all come up, nobody on the post now. They're trying to play offside, get tighter to their markers. Whether he was the first choice, I don't know, but he got injured no sooner than he arrived at Leicester. He hasn't played that much. It's a storming run here, and it's a beautifully taken goal by the midfield player Craig Bryson. And that again exposes the shortcomings in Leicester City this season. No one closed him down, and Bryson has shown in his career with Derby, he has got an eye for goal. Made the absolute maximum of that opportunity. Derby 2, Leicester 1, they've turned it around. Well, again, there's no real build-up play. It's about being first to the ball, being more dynamic. There's the header. He just wins the challenge the first time, then wins it the second time here. Goes past King far too easily. Morgan can't get there. He doesn't get a slide in. It's far too easy for Bryson. Two midfield players, King and Drinkwater, should do better. And by the time he realises he might need to slide Morgan, it's a bit too late, and it's a really good finish. You also have to question, Schmeichel showed a lot of that far post. Vardy. Now, Albrighton. Shaping to cross, and then eventually doing so towards Akazaki. And he got in front of uh, the defender. A little bit more on it, maybe, and it could have been 2-2. Lovely little cross into the box from Albrighton. It was played wide by Vardy. And they make their way into the box. Does it hit the arm of Keo? It probably does, but there's not much he can do about it. Once again, Okazaki's movement's really good when crosses come into the box. Time up for Hoop. Keo gets there. Chilwell. Drink water. Good angle this for Albrighton. Pushed out by Carson. Gray. Well, when he made contact with a lot of the goal to see. He thought 2-2 two -two from number 2-2, two -two. but uh, it wasn't to be. Well, it was the right cross from Albrighton to start with, puts it into that dangerous area. He's just really unlucky. You could say that he should pick his spot. He just makes good connection with it. And Carson knows nothing about it. Could bounce off Carson, but watch here. It almost comes off. The bed is a bit too long in the tooth to be caught like that, and the cross is a decent one. Well, when it went past Simpson and Russell was coming in, he really thought, he certainly thought, 3-1. It was a difficult one for Simpson to deal with. He gets any sort of decent touch and he could put it in his own net. And he decides in the end to take a gamble and let it run. It's a clever throw from Mares. Buddy! It's straight at Carson. Get on the end of this delivery from Damari Gray. And they have done. Wes Morgan, it is 2-2 on the motorway at Leicester in 10 days' time. He comes from the far post. A 
On that occasion, Keogh is marking on the wrong side of him. He's got to be in front of Morgan. It's too easy for Morgan. Look at the six marking Morgan. He's actually a little shirt tucked there, but he's marking on the wrong side. He can never be first to the ball from the position that he's taken up against the Leicester centre back. And there's the little feet. Actually comes off Keogh. Can be nippy, can be very nippy. Chance for handball. That would have been the most immediate of impacts. Mark Clattenburg now does blow his whistle in Derby's favour, but not the one that Camera wanted that Derby really craved for here. Well, it certainly hits the defender on the arm. Well, it's going towards that far post. I don't know that Hoot knows too much about it, but the ball travels a little bit further. Mares, it's a lovely ball for Drinkwater, pushed out by Carson, and Baird just gets it away.